everybody and I'm standing on the ladder right here's the ceiling and we're working on top tanks today today's project is my special project green J shrimp tank and what we're doing here is we are trying to make the very best green J shrimp that we can now normally I will reset this every so often it's not this tank is not quite ready to be reset yet so we're not going to quite reset it but what we're going to do is pull out all the moss see all this moss then we'll be able to get a good view of all the shrimp and we're not going to reset it because i'm trying to get this colony built up with the best shrimp that i can for my outside projects this spring i want to try to breed a whole bunch outside and a great big tub and so first thing we're going to do is pull out all the moss and see what we got all right let's get started so the first thing we're going to do is get some water and put it in a bucket right here and all the moss we pull out we will put in this bucket so in case there's any shrimpies the shrimpies will be safe the good thing is this tank doesn't look like it has any algae or anything like that so let's get busy all right let's get going I have no idea how many shrimp are in here. I know there's a lot of really good ones. So what we're gonna do here is pull this moss out, being very careful not to get baby shrimp on it. shrimpies in here. There's a good amount of shrimp in here. Not tons. But this tank hasn't been that long since I did it. Since I reset it. So I wasn't expecting a whole bunch in here. But what we're worried about is getting only the perfect shrimp. That's what we're trying to do here. Shrimps, get off there, shrimps. Come on, shrimps. All right. So now I'm going to go through and get these little hunks of moss and these rocks. to stir up any stuff in here so we can see what we're doing ideally Oh, 
Well, okay, so we got everything pulled out of here. And we have some really good shrimp in here. Wow. I'm going for a little bit lighter than my other greens with these guys. Still got a few oddball looking ones like that. But really, most are really, and I didn't mean to do that. But check that out. Those are some really good green jigs. Okay. So now what we're going to do is put an Azzy wafer in. Let them gather up all in one spot. And we'll pull out the ones that don't quite measure up. Alright, so while the time lapse was going, I got most of the obviously bad ones. You can take a look at them here. You can see most of these were plainly bad. Some of them have like the yellow stripe. I try to take, I've bred the yellow stripe out, but a funny thing is I've noticed with these, I'm going more for the green crown look. And it's a little bit tougher and the yellow stripes are coming back you try to lighten them up just a little bit and the yellow stripes start coming back but usually the big old ones with the yellow stripe that are faint are all right but the younger ones with the distinct yellow stripe are the ones i'm trying to pull out because a lot of them will get a faint stripe eventually when they get great big and old well the females will anyway but so now I'm going to show you guys my next trick. We got to pull out all the tricks with the green jades. <laughs> Let me show you. My next trick will be this crazy flashlight. Oh my goodness. All right. Let me show you. These greens. If you get it right on here. Well, with any shrimp, really. You'll be able to see, there we go, you see what I'm talking about there? And now I can better see the ones that ain't so hot. So let's see if we can find some more kind of crappy ones. Now, like you can tell, this one right here is kind of... Yeah, and then that's what happens. <laughs> Here it is right. Here, I think. Let's see. All right. Well, I just stuck my flashlight in the water. That's nice. You can see these guys are really... Pretty stupendous, I, I would say. We gotta really try hard to find some that don't quite measure up. Let's see. Hmm. I really don't see too many. But now, we'll put this tank back together. This one's right here let's see if i can get this one come on get in there man come on walk in there there we go nice got that one let's see if we can find a couple more going like this all right i think you can see here's one Right there, it kind of, and that's getting real picky. We can get this guy. Where'd you go? No, we don't want that. You, you're perfect. <laughs> oh man, here we are. All right, where is that? 
This is hard. Okay. Well, I think that's going to be... Well, and sometimes when you use the light, you can find them that don't have much green to them. Like, maybe... Yeah. They all look pretty good to me. Even under the light. There's a couple on there that... Here's one back here in the back. Let's see if I can get it. Yep. All right, that one is so borderline, I'm not even going to sweat not getting it. As you can see here, what we got. All right, so now I can keep a really good eye on it when we put this tank back together. Okay, and so now we got to put a little bit of moss back in. We don't want to put too much in because we want to be able to see our shrimp buddies. And I want to be able to stay on top of this. Wow, it is for springtime before my big projects outside. This will be my, these guys will be the seed for my expansion of greens outside this summer. Watch out shrimpies. Watch out, shrimpies. Uh, put some rocks down here. I'm dripping water all over my camera. That's awesome. Alright. And this will hold this moss down here in place. And the moss will grow all around it and end up enveloping the tank. And so there we have it. Put back together. All right, that's what we got now. I am so excited. I've been working a lot of years on green jades, and I've set these part, these group, this group apart to be extra, extra special for future expansions. Can't wait to see what these guys produce. And let's end this video at the Skittles tank where all these greens we pulled out go live. There you go, man. There you go, greens, man. Green deeds. There you go, green mans. Come on. All right. There we have it. I'll call that a project for the day completed. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.